Hello and welcome to a brand new episode of Let's Play Dragon Quest XI. I'm your host Gamora and a lot of interesting stuff has uh, happened. I mean, we did get the the holy water to cure that kid. But uh, as soon as we got to town, those people from... Uh, uh, what's the... Oh, I already forgot what it's called. Heliodor, I think. You know, those dudes that were chasing us. They're still chasing us. And they're still here, and they're they're now here, so uh, we're gonna have to deal with that. Also, something else I noticed, like if you see right here, like we're waving, right? And it says the directional pad up to wave, but if you actually keep pressing up, there's like more of them. There's even a funny dance. Look at that. You'd think the jester could do more better dancing. Let's see, thumbs up. Sob, point, step back, clench fist, act tough, thumbs up, back in. Okay, so hocus pocus, I don't know what that means. I guess there's only, that's the only one for down. Alright, well, whatever. That was fun new, uh, to look at. Alright, so it looks like now we have to make our way to the inn. By sneaking past all these guards so it's pretty much across the river so we're gonna have to sneak our way over there now while we are sneaking over there um, I might as well plug the channel if you guys are enjoying this series I'd appreciate your support so hit that subscribe button whether you're on YouTube rumble bit shoot or Odyssey and check these episodes live on twitch oh man I was going from sneak to... Oh, man, they're just everywhere. Am I just supposed to beat them up or something? Can't jump down there. Hmm. I wonder if, like... Oh, whoa. That was a close one. Well, we can't... well let's see if we can just... I was wondering if we could just get into a fight with them, but I guess we can. I guess this is not a sneaking thing. Unless we start back at the beginning after this. Let's hope they're not as crit happy as before. Alright, now that um now that we have a fifth character, they can uh take the opportunity to knock characters out of our party. I guess it is... That's probably why one of our characters pretty much got kidnapped. Is because they could replace him with a... Sylvanda. Oh, he's on, um... We actually don't have control over him. Let's switch that up. I don't like having people in my party that I can't control. Oh man, I wanted to get a shot with uh, Silvando. I wanted to see what he could do. Fabulous, darling. Now let's start using some of these points. So let's see. Six points. Crit chance by two. Attack power by three. All right, let's do that. Oh, we already, we already did those. Sword stance. Increases parries. Oh no, we're, we're working on... Actually, we don't need that one. Maybe some of these. Zap. That seems nice. Targets all enemies and makes them disappear. Now we need more for that. I guess we'll just have to hold off on that. How about this? Spooky Aura. Alright, nothing for you. Probably the same for that. Alright, so let's see what you got. Hot lick. Seems like a move he would have. Charm plus 10. Tap dance. Flame slash is always nice. Hip. Hip now hip. 
A wallop with a whip sometimes confuses them. You just have to buy a whip, but that sounds pretty interesting. Hmm. Yep, let's do that. Got the Dragon Slash, and it looks like there's a lot of, uh, you know, similar skills. Oh, we can do multiple ones at a time. I didn't realize that. Cool. All right, I guess that'll be enough for now. All right, let's just move on. I guess we can... Is there any way to get past this dude without getting into a fight? Okay. Oh, but there's nothing for us to do. I got tricked. We couldn't get past him anyways. Ah, but he's, uh... Well, I gotta say, he's got guts. But there's no way he's gonna win. Wow, I'm surprised he's not, uh... In yellow HP. Now let's just do a normal attack with you. Also, that hit that hit that she does does restore her MP. Oh, let's see. I want to see what he can do. Oh wow, he's got a lot of stuff. Automatically restore at nine HP each single. So it's like regen. Cures our all party members of sleep. Raises attack power of single member, agility of single member, agility of everyone. Reduces agility of an enemy. We got the flames, we got the hot lick. Short, sharp, shock that can snap a fellow party member out of sleep, confusion, beguilement, and paralysis. That's bound to be helpful. All right. So it looks like we can't make our way this way. That means we probably have to go across the other bridge, maybe? All right, we made it to the end. So let's see if we can get to the roof from here now. I thought this lady was tied up. There's no reply. She seems too to be too too frightened to speak. You wish to sleep here now, Banna. It is important to help people who are in need. No? Always they teach me this when I was a little bambina. Oh cool. You must be exhausted this late at hour. Yeah, sure, why not? Might as well get the rest in. It can't hurt to continue this uh, with full HP. I'm sure Eric can wait. I'm sure he's not being, you know, tortured or something. All right, so let's see what's up here. Oh, there was a book up here. We never went up here. I forgot to. Somewhere under the rainbow. Once upon a time on a lovely summer's day, a rainbow appeared in the sky. The weather was so warm and relaxing that it made the rainbow sleepy, and he let out a big yawn. As he yawned, a single tear fell out the corner of his eye, and the sparkling sunlight split, in, split it into uh, seven different colored lights from which little baby lamplings were born. Little baby... Uh, the leafy lampling with his bright green cap of leaves, the luminous lamping, lamplings with his bright blue flame and lurid lampling with his shining yellow body. But the red light was jealous of his beautiful brothers, so he gobbled the orange and violet lights up whole. As punishment for this terrible sin, he was turned into a lava lampling. Horns grew from his head as he was banished to hell. Where he dwells to this day. Well, that turned uh, 
I'm turning like a whole 180, man. Jeez. Dude, that's crazy. You still can't... This... This is... I think... Don't you guys have like... um. If I'm not mistaken, don't you guys have like universal health care? Yeah, you guys have free health care. And this is this is what I say to to people all the time that uh <laughs> that like, you know, that shit on America. Like, oh, it costs two thousand dollars um for an ambulance to come pick you up. But that ambulance is here in five minutes, guaranteed. I mean even ten minutes and I'd say that's that's pushing it, honestly. I mean, sure, it's expensive, but, um, four hours, that's an insane wait time. Something must be going on. Although, you know, I, I do see some benefits to free healthcare, but still. Oh, we just made it back here. Oops. I could have sworn that was a different robe. I'm losing my mind here. I thought we were supposed to. Eat. There's nothing. Did I miss something? There's nothing for us here. Oh. I see. Here we go. Well, we sure have a pretty good balance. It's been like that since COVID. But you'd think by now that things would be better, no? I mean, it's... The majority of COVID stuff is bound to be over by now. I it's been like two years. Like it's been over two years. Show like two yourself. and a half now. Or you can stay hidden and see what happens to your friends. Something tells me he's not the patient type. We better get to Eric before things turn nasty. Ah, there's a gondola stop off to the northwest near the contest stage. We could sneak up close to them from there. Let's hop on a gondola and glide on over. Mustn't keep dear Eric waiting. <laughs> I like how Silvando was like, he's not the patient guy. And I'm here like... You know, resting at the end overnight. And so I think we... How do we make our way down here? Hmm, I guess we have to go this way, right? Probably no other... Oh, never mind. I meant this way. That's what I meant. Oops. Four weeks for a telephone appointment? And those are pretty much useless most of the time. I mean, how are you going to diagnose somebody over the phone? Although, but with your, with your, uh, with your daughter, that's crazy. You'd think, um, you know, young children would be, you know, somewhat a priority. Oh, nice. I like how, I guess, if you defeat an enemy, at least that's what it looked like. Unless that's just their death animation. But we defeated her with whoosh. 
Or defeated the guard with Whoosh and he just kind of flew away. Ah, let's just hit this dude and get some of our MP back. Well, at least we're getting good experience off these dudes. Now let's see, I think... Yep. Oh, we can't? Of course. How are we supposed to get down there, then? Hmm... Hello. And that dude from far away saw us, but not him. What's this dude? Open the door. It's me. It's no dark. There's no the dark spawn. Por favor, let me in. door won't budge. A voice can be heard coming from within. Whoever is in there sounds frightened and seems to be hiding from the dark spawn. Maybe there's something we can... Nope, nothing for us to do over here. So we can just run past you guys. No need to get into a fight. This will just take too long. Are we supposed to, like, go on the roof again or something? Oh, we can go down this way. I see. I didn't think that that was the right path to go. Oh, but we can't go in there. Man, this is ridiculous. Do we have to go, like, back inside the inn or something? Great. Let's just didn't deal with them. How bad can it be? Well, let's try some of his uh his magic. I don't know his spells. Oh, he doesn't have an AOE one. Yeah, whatever. Let's just do some magic. Let's see if we can take them all out in one round. Hmm. Uh, let's just be an extra safe. I was going to do a whoosh with her. But it's probably better to heal. You never know when we might get hit. Chances are her whoosh wouldn't have finished them off anyways. sure took a lot of damage. <laughs> but we're still good. And I know that Eric is, uh, you know, you know, in kind of a dire situation, but I think we're going to take another rest. I think maybe we have to follow the the ropes Maybe we can make our all, make our way all the way to the to the gondola from a specific roof. I don't think I don't think I saw on any other paths. So let's see. Where was that row? Okay, here's one of them. So this one takes us to the top of the roof. Oh, but there's no way for us to jump down. 
Hmm. All right, so we can't... Oh, we need to go from that side, the center. Well, at least this gave us a bird's eye view. So if we go from the center, we can make it there. But how do we get in the center? I think I know how. I think we pre we're pretty much next to it. Oof. I was not meaning to run into this dude. Let's go. Uh, you know, actually when you're sprinting, it's not as easy to direct where you want to go. You know what? I probably should have hit the other one. I could have taken one of them out. Oh, I guess we'll take them out anyways. Not bad. Now, how much experience do we get for these people? 172. So we get 30 gold apiece. Now oh, we learn new magic. Oh, don't tell me we can't go this way either. You've got to be kidding me. Man, they really want you to go a specific way. Unless there's something over there that I'm missing. Let's take a quick peek over there. Nope. Ugh. It's like a... It's like a straight up puzzle. These are two different types of enemies. Or maybe it's just the lighting. It almost looks like those guys in the back look taller. Hmm. Now let's just do a whole bunch of AoE. Then we're gonna spend the whole episode lost. Getting kind of ridiculous now. All, all our paths are are blocked. I think we tried everything. Uh... Oh, mid heal. How oh, nice! We get a better heal. I kind of mashed through. We got a new spell, and I kind of mashed through it. For a second, I thought the spell was called Michael. I was like, what the? What kind of spell is Michael? You know what? These dudes are different. They got different helms. But they're all called the same thing, so... I guess it's not, um... Right? Yeah, Hel Heliodorn Guard, A, B, and D. Yeah, they're all the same people, so... I don't know why they look different. They do the same damage. It looks like they got the same weapons. So, hmm. Oh well. I guess it doesn't matter. Let's just, um... Let's just take, make sure we don't die, since we are gaining a whole bunch of experience anyways. Alright, let's take a look at the map again. Alright, so I don't think... Yeah, it doesn't seem like we can get... Man, what way are we supposed to go there? We can't even use any of the other, any of the other gondola ports. The dude just walked straight into us. He didn't even see us. We we're just standing there. And I was just sitting here trying to find a path. It doesn't seem like there is a path. 
It seems like we're gonna have to like walk through the buildings or something or like enter in from a building or see what uh, the dude's what was it called hot tongue or something hot lick I really got to see what this does oh nice that's actually a pretty cool attack we did it, darlings. all right let's just make sure there's no other ones okay now we can look at the map so it looks like can I zoom in or oh, I can so it looks like these dark marks are places that we cannot go so we can't go over there and make our way down this way we can't go down those stairs to go down there what other way we can't even go there there's a little block there i thought maybe we can use this is there there's this bridge here. I wonder if you can go like underneath. Wasn't there like a metal? G oh, there's that metal gate that's closed. Is there a way to get to it from the other side, maybe? Hmm. We, c we can get to this gondola, but I doubt that that's what they want us to do. I really don't even see a path. Hmm. It almost seems like we definitely have to go into someone's house. Well, we've been in the end, so let's not deal with that anymore. There's nothing for us over there. There's that gondola over there. We could just jump it, but nope. And these guys respawn too, so that's great. Maybe the church can give a sanctuary. You may be the dark spawn, but we are all equal in the eyes of heavens of the heavens. If you wish to pray, prego. What brings you to that? I can't believe that they all just think we're the dark spawn because someone said that we are. It's ridiculous. Alright, well, we're getting pretty close to the end of the episode, so I think I'm gonna just end it here. I'm getting kind of frustrated with uh, finding our path, but all right, I guess hopefully in the next episode, well, I, I can't imagine being lost for the whole next episode, so I think we're we're probably going to find a path in the next episode, so come, uh, come check out the next episode where we go save Eric, so thanks for watching, um, and have a good day.